Hi there Pachito. This is my work table today. I've just opened the wonderful box that's taken just over two months to arrive to me with my two chamisen in. Uh, there's a definite difference in quality so I thought I'd do a little video and you could all you guys could have a look. Right this is the first one. It's a nice red colour and it's got a lot of dings and nicks on it and it feels a little bit older than the other one that I have and that's okay but that will need to be reskinned right there. Something I noticed was the fact that the top skin has been cut a lot thicker along here than the bottom one. That's kind of interesting to me anyway. I don't know if this will come out in video but the inside seems to be pretty raw there's no shaping or or anything the pegs are a nice light wood they all appear to be uh, the correct ones to go with this chamisen they're nice <laughs> right this is the nice one it feels a bit more modern to me it's really really shiny really smooth the dents and nicks don't seem to be that bad it's got nice brass fittings really nice I like this one a lot <laughs> look at this I have real mixed feelings about using animal skin like cat and dog but I can't be helped it's traditional so there we go so we have this one nice shiny wood inside looks a lot smoother than the other one I don't know if you can quite catch that but this one on the skinning is about the same it's just under a centimeter I'll measure that later if anybody's interested but this one is the playable one I think it's worth every penny these are the little bits that came with the really nice chamisen um, nice dokake neo pegs really nice dark wood right here we have my absolute favorite this was a complete bargain from ebay i think it was about 40 quid 80 dollars or something no skin on it but i don't care this is the damage across the end of there which i know some people have asked to see a bit more the wood is just so beautiful I don't know if you can see in this horrible yellow light in this workroom but it's lovely a bit battered old plain brass fittings maybe but the length of it is good the joints fit together really snugly and beautifully nice brass ferrule on the end in here we have lovely label and some shaping smooth it's obviously been reskinned a load of times but here we go a little bit of repairs to the inside but nice and sound joints all fit together nothing moving that needs a little bit of a bash to just tighten that up a bit when I get this one reskinned this was probably going to be the one I play. This is probably going to be my baby. Itamaki, well, put together from two different shamisen, I think. All ribs and everything, but there we go. Haven't put this together at all, so I can't tell you how they fit. Tall comma, evenly spaced about. 12 millimeters apart notches plastic budgie strings and finally I just did a quick line up all the budgie I have is plastic an oak one the horn and timber one that I'm working on myself and the quarter so sawn brown oak that I haven't even started to shape yet but they're all roughly about the same size although the plastic one seems to be really heavy and 
bigger for some reason, although it's not. But I still need to make the this one, the horn and wood one, a little bit smaller to be more the size of the Suguru Shamisen Bachi. So there we have it, that's my quick review of these and I will give updates on reskinning and everything as time goes on and I get all the bits together. See you guys!